Hey, what's up, everybody? I'm back here with another Escape from Tarkov video. Today, we're going to be taking a look at the Marked Room Key on Customs. We're going to be analyzing whether or not it's a good investment. As of January 5th, 2021, the key is sitting around 700 to 800K for 25 uses of the key. This is a disclaimer, as if the key price has changed, it can affect the information of this video. But I think most likely, even if the key value drops, I will have the same opinion at the end of the video. Before we get into the video, just want to remind you all that if this video here today does help you out, or if the videos in the past have helped you out, be sure to drop a like and sub for more content and guide videos like these. If you have any suggestions, be sure to let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to respond to them. Also, just a reminder that I stream on Twitch almost daily, I answer questions live for newer players, and there's always a thing or two I know and can teach. So if you guys want some extra help, be sure to follow me on there with the link in the description. And with intros out the way, let's get straight into it. All right, so first let's talk about where the marked room is and what we can obtain from it and our chances of making the initial 700 to 800k back. So the marked room is on the third floor of the three-story dorms on customs. It has a chance of spawning rare guns, ammo, and containers. It spawns containers like key tools, documents cases, meds cases, mag boxes, dog tag cases, and even ammo crates. It does not spawn sick cases, items cases, weapons cases, or any thick items or weapons cases anymore as of the last wipe. With that being said, when it comes to key tools, docs cases, and dog tag cases, you can keep them inside of your container with the ammo crates even though they can fit inside your container you cannot actually put it inside of there and the other containers are way too big to fit inside speaking of docs cases and key tools you have a chance of finding rare keys inside of them including key cards like the red green or black key cards in the docs cases and with the key tools you can find rare keys like the emercom key which i have found and i'll be getting into later now i know what you guys are thinking what are the chances of that even happening what are the chances i even find any of that or the chances of me finding keys inside of it but I'm going to assure you that you will make your money back in the 25 chances you have. I made my money back in the first five runs I had with the marked key. I found two key tools and in one of them was a key that I sold for 400k. It was the Emercom key. I'm sure you guys know you need it for a quest right now. I died in one of the runs and only got a 450k for the key tools to therapist. But the run I survived, I sold for 650k and ultimately profited 1.4 mil, including the key I found. And I still have many uses of the marked key left. I think I have like another 18 or 19 after that. Another thing to look for are rare guns like the RSAS when looting. This gun is currently worth 1.2 million rubles as it's needed for a mechanic quest. So if you survive the raid, you can profit a lot of money. One tip I will give is be sure you have extra rubles on you to go to the van extract next to the dorms. It costs 7k rubles and is going to save you many times and give you immense profits for all the runs that you do survive. So be sure to pack some extra cash in your docks or sick cases. I highly recommend buying the key because even if you die, you can still put dock tag cases, key tools, and docks cases in your secured container and sell straight to therapists for crazy profits or use them yourself in your stash. Also, with that being said, there are a lot of variety of items that I didn't go into in this video that will profit a lot of money. Overall, I feel like it's a great investment. Also, not a lot of people have the key right now, so you're not going to be fighting a lot of people at the marked room right now. So that's another great thing is that you can go in and out clean without any gunfights. And if you guys don't believe me, I'm sure I'm showing some videos up on the screen of me finding the key tools right now. You know, test it out yourself, buy the key. If you guys have like two mil, I would recommend just buying the key. If you only have like one mil, I wouldn't buy the key because then you're going to be a little broke. I'll make sure I have some extra pocket cash in case you die in some of the runs. But yeah, I hope this video helped you all out or persuaded you guys to buy the marked key. As of right now, early wipe, it can be very useful and you can profit a lot from it. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and stuff for more. And be sure to check out my Twitch in the description down below. Thank you all and have a great rest of your day.